Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Paintivity, and today I am trying out a game called Kane. Um, wow, this music's a little intense. Uh, as you can see, there's a baby on the screen, and all I know is it's a point-and-click adventure, sort of. I don't know about adventure, if that's the right word, but uh, you're pregnant. What are you doing to me right now with this volume? It was not like this before. It just kind of ramps up and then calms back down, but it's super tense. Um, all I know is you wake up and you're pregnant, and things happen, and it's kind of like stasis. Um, so, I don't know, it was free, and I was like, this is actually really well done, so I figured I would check it out for myself. I don't, I don't know how long the game is, or anything like that, but we'll just see what happens and go from there. So, it is from the Brotherhood. And I've heard a lot of great things about it so far, especially with the work they put into it, and it's free, which people are just like, seriously? Like, how? How could it be free? Whoa. <laughs> wow. It's pretty, this is pretty epic for the beginning of a game. Ugh, it gives me the chills. What in the world? Alrighty then. So this must be us. She looks all... Sticky. Is she dreaming? Okay. I don't want a child. I've never <laughs> wanted one. I, I had a plan and this wasn't part of it. Relax. I promise this won't hurt a bit. Seems a lot like Sims no. right now. <laughs> Thanks. Just a few more items to check off and we can start. Name and ID? Hadley. 14 0 31 21 0 9. And the procedure is being paid for by a third party? Yes. Whoa. No explanation needed. No family listed? No family. This is some pretty cool tech. It's just me. A special order here. Ah, that's for me. We'll write that. Let's begin. What in the world are Nurse. they doing? Now, count back from 10. <sighs> 10, 9. You'll be just fine, sweetie. Eight, That's not very comforting. Seven. Yeah, during that countdown, like when I've actually had surgery, I make it pretty far before I'm out. And sometimes the doctors are astounded and other times I'm terrified. I'm like, don't be working on me. Fancy. I'm, I'm, I really like this. So she just like woke up pregnant with this like big daddy like running around. The heck? Where am I? Yeah, I'd be freaking out too. <laughs> Whoa. Kane Corporation, thank you for your contribution. Extraction procedure. Weird that it's like a kid voice saying that. Oh, screw that. Whoa. Okay. What are you? Apparently he just does circles, I think. What are you doing here? I see it. What do you want me to do with it? Well, let's see here. 
Beginning doing? fetal extraction pre-check. What the hell? So maybe I'm not supposed to be doing anything right now. Scan complete. Subject in place. He is ready for extraction. Cause it's not letting me do anything? Whoa. What is shaking? There we go. Alright. Can we, like, get up, please? He mumbles constantly between gasping breaths. Okay. What do you want me to do with this? Can we scalpel him? Well, that didn't work out. Bad time to, like, be figuring this out. Can we scalpel him? Go away. What in the world? Switch over. I don't know why we would need this. Stained what? What is that? Alright. Fetal extraction arm. That's wow. That's got to be so much worse than actually like having a kid. Seriously. Stained Betty. Dried blood. Obviously, it's a floor. Okay, viable specimen. Can you not move? It is not that serious. What can I do with you? Gotta be able to do something with this. I'm gonna vote that the scalpel. Other precision cutting work. There we go. Oh. Just had to get him in the right spot, I suppose. Ew, it's like a tail. Okay. Scan complete. Whoa. Subject no longer present. Fetal extraction cancelled. It's like I'm still pregnant. Well, you know, for someone who doesn't want kids, she she wants to work pretty hard. This is all because of the baby. Of course. Ew. All right, so. This isn't right. She's like, I don't know what I did to become pregnant. I really don't want to deal with you. Okay. Let's go to the computer terminal and see if we can do anything with this data. Whoa. What in the world? I don't know if I can use this. I'm gonna try. Scan complete. Hmm. Subject no longer present. Okay, so you're Fetal the extraction guy canceled. talking. All right, let's go over here. She runs pretty fast for a pregnant lady. Right. Logs and notices. Calibration. Error, error, error. So after the software update. Huh, okay. Whoa, they take out the uterus and everything. Yes, it's crazy. Failure to extract, so a lot of problems. Should I engage? No, I don't know. Let's see. What happens. No valley target selected. Happy Mother's Day. Ha. Well, I would like to, you know, like, leave. Can we use this here? Can we use this here? I like <laughs> the little face in the background is just deadpan. It's useless. I really don't want to mess with him. Well, you know what? Can we just go here? Leave, lady. They're installed around the metal support infrastructure, but the squalid state of the laboratory suggests they've not been used in a long time. I better be able to do something with you. 
You are a computer terminal, after all. Obviously. But we can't do anything. So basically, you're watching me, Lifeless Hulk. Um. Gross. He's full of gas. Apparently there's not a whole lot right now. Like, I think... I, the computer, I've got to use it. So, what, a, what the hell am I doing? I don't want to engage. That's specifically for the arm. A data disk that contains the medical records of one patient, which is her. So... Maybe... I was hoping we could fold the computer. Come on. That's crazy. Scan a host. You controls the extraction system. I must be missing something. Ew. <laughs> Gelatinous residue that smells like ammonia. Well, we're putting that away. <clears throat> Black metal struts, that's not what I want. Floor. What are you? I feel like there's a lot I'm looking for right now. I don't know. Let's go mess with you some more. Surgical bed terminal. Well, I wonder if she's locked in here. I don't think that's going to work. I think I tried it before. So I figured we could trick it into thinking it worked out. So much for that. <clears throat> I've suddenly turned into this Hulk guy. I don't want that. It's not gonna work. Scan complete. Subject no longer present. Fetal hmm. extraction cancelled. Okay. Obviously. Drainage pipe cover. I didn't see that before. Covers all but welded to the floor with putrid surgical sludge. So, make it happen? Can we get our scalpel back? Maybe? No? You guys are killing me. Should not be this difficult. Obviously, it's a floor. Computer terminal. I feel like there's something I'm missing here. Curtain operational status, which I knew. I don't want to mess with that anymore. So, I'm going to figure this out. Okay, so we're back at the computer. And... Let's see. Program. Um, logs and notices. How? Error. Error. No valid target selected. Okay, so I think I finally figured it out. We're going to try this one more time. We're going to do this. Come on, run over here. Come on, make it happen. Scan complete. Okay. Subject in place. All right. It is ready for extraction. All right. So now that should allow us to get into the files. Which is just crazy because I'm like, why didn't I think of that? I'm, I have no idea. Like, why just now? All right, engage. Begin room extraction there we process. go. So now we're going to see what would have happened. Why are you telling yourself to breathe? Ain't nothing happening to you because you chose to do it the hard way. Whoa. Okay. Huh. 
Not really what I would have considered an, an extraction. I mean, technically, you got him. <laughs> I'm gonna guess he exploded. Seeing as how his uh, breath thing, like the, the gases were coming out of it. Oops. What the hell? Fire detected in laboratory. Please use the demarcated exits. How are you not dead or pushing out a baby or something right now? What the hell? Get out of here. Yeah, you do. Uh, <laughs> the empty void. Whatever's down there, it can't be much worse than up here. Control terminal. What can we do? Can't go there. I'd rather you not go here, because if you slip and fall, that, that's. <laughs> <not good. laughs> that was awesome. That, yeah, that was awesome. <laughs> but we're somewhere. And to think a fall could have been a good thing for me a few months ago. Yeah, well, get over yourself. Uncalled for, Hadley. Funny. Uncalled for. You're lucky that like you haven't died yet or something. I don't know. A glint. Light bounces off the contorted metal item. So can we touch it? Ew. It's like mushy in here. A mangled scalpel, because that's handy now. Maybe. Alright. So the point and click is not as crazy as I thought, but it's a lot more detailed. You have to, it's very fine tuned. Alright, come on, crazy lady. Let's use your mangled scalpel to get this thing, because I don't even know why we want it. Well, then stop being stupid. Burning structure. Because we want to look at that. What is that? Gross. Exposed insulation. Let's see if we could just scratch that out. So condensation kind of messed with it. Uh, your mother would be just as confused. What do you want me to do? Are, are you just being the shit because you can? All right. Can we use this this here? I mean, it seems unrealistic. An acrid burning stench emanates from melted plastic. Why do we want that? Maybe it's like no. Wait, no. Thanks. Lacerated floor structures. Nothing I can do with this. Hmm, okay. Everything's just a mess, so we're gonna put that away. What else can we find? Is there anything you could do with this? Can you just fall through it or something? Because I don't think we can get back up. Huh. Well, alright then, let's just go through the door that just didn't look like a door. I mean, why not? Whoa. Looks like a shrine. Some voodoo shit. Maybe stabbing that oak wasn't such a bad thing. Ew. What? So... Okay, so the Omnitech tool. The one recalled for an unanticipated occupational incident. The box is locked. Door is inaccessible. Door locked. Door locked. Door locked? What are you? Sealed circular airlock. Well, let's go look at stuff well like sealed tin of protein powder gross gee thanks what? what? hello? who's there? it's dark in here he's probably one of these doors I, I can't see you who are you? why, why can't I see you? Because your eyeballs are ripped out. What is that feeling? Ew. My hands. My feet. My fucking skin. I want some spares. What? What? Bad joke. Where am I? Okay, okay. Keep calm. Wow. Is there an accident? 
Where are you? <laughs> Seems legit. I, I can't. I can't remember my name. Okay, just talk faster. Hmm. Hello? Are you there? It's like he's moving around. Speak up, buddy. Maybe he fell asleep. Man, she just makes this seem like it's just gonna ruin her day. Atmosphere term terminal. Oh. Wait, say that again. What am I doing? Activate PDT required for terminal access. Okay. So, would this work? I wonder. For crying out loud. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Are you just gonna pout every time I try to do something? Do we care about the atmosphere? Well, we have to unlock the the thing. Let's poke it. Can we poke it? <laughs> Maybe if I jam it in. On second thought. <laughs> so do it. You. Let's see what else. Not a whole lot going on in here. Gross. It's banned, okay. Do I really need it? Is she gonna go Hulk on me or what? Hey, come back. That's not what I want. Hmm. Don't worry, little guy. I'm not that stupid. Yeah, let's not say that we did. I wonder. <laughs> Can you cut him down? Cut something? I mean, why not? Nobody got time for this. <laughs> that was awesome. Ain't nobody got time for this. Gee, thanks for that reference. One of those ones I was just like, did we have to have that? <laughs> why is it such pain in my ass? And why do we need this? Stupid, stupid Hadley! Okay. He's gonna be pissed off the whole time. I feel like we're gonna have to get that other piece. Somehow. Crusted blood and candle wax and something that smells like ammonia? Question mark. Gross. I'm just running in circles. Okay. Well, you know what? This video has gone long enough for what it is. Even though it's not the best, I would love to keep going. Um, it's something I'm gonna have to work on, but so far I really like it. The um, everything about it is actually really amazing. Uh, it, you know, point and click, but it's free and well done actually. So I mean, it just seems like every room is gonna pose a challenge, and you don't always see what you need to do next. Um, and so I'm gonna have to figure out specifically for this, like, what am I being told that I need to figure out and uh, kind of like in the other room like why does she want that weird thing in the center of the room excuse me oh my goodness it's been a very long day anyway I suggest you guys go play this it's super cool and um, I think I'm gonna be coming back to this because I really want to know what happens I, I want to know the rest of the story like first of all why is she pregnant why are they trying to take her kid 
um, and on top of it, like, why do we have this weird sacrifice in the middle of everything? Like, I don't know. There's just a lot to it. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed it, even though you watched me run around in circles like a moron for a little while. And, um, I am sure I'll be coming back to this one shortly. I got some other stuff I have to take care of first, such as the Wolf Among Us. And then I will be back to this one. So if you liked it or if you have any suggestions, leave them for me in the box below. And I will get, I will catch you guys next time. Thanks for joining the universe. Bye. Witches over there will keep out of trouble. We have a glamour switch as it is. It makes the most sense. Seems like it's business versus emotion. You get to keep your fucking and a little birdie suggested I don't you burn the tree. Expect me to bow down to your little woman. No, no, why would we do that? Don't think for a second that this is over. So what? Are the gonna show up?